Uh, hello everyone in this video we are going to show you how easy to import a DXF file uh, into our next controller and convert it into a 3d part program right now you are looking at a DXF file with all bending information these are the bending lines as you can see some of them are dotted lines and some of them are dashed lines uh, this will give the information of the, the bending direction, actually. This information will be very handy when we are importing the file into the controller. As you can see here, we have another layer uh, which is telling us the material type and thickness. Good thing is, next controller can read this information and uh, bring those information into the part program. Now what I will do, I will take this TXF and import it to this CNC control and make a 3D part program in just a minute. Here you can see our next TNC software uh, and you can see all the programs prepared before. Now I want to find my drawing which is located under D drive just I'll click on this and go to the data folder and under that there's flats and it's tap demo there is uh, my file you can see the type is DXF and confirm here we have a new window uh, which uh, gives us the data which will be imported into the, the controller here we see these layers, which is zero for the drawing and text for the material type and thickness. Uh, you also choose this bend attribute if it is dotted or dashed for minus and plus angles. So next can calculate all the, the bends correctly. And now we click OK. Uh, here we can give a name to our part program. I just leave it as it is and can then click OK. Okay, now our part is here now and we see the part drawing just at the bottom of the screen. Here we have thickness, material and all the information about the bend are given here. Right now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to tool up and click on the auto tool and uh, next we'll choose the correct tools for me for this part it's very easy and I'll click on generate stations and the next step uh, I will do is I will go to the simulation now I see the machine tooling and part and I'll click on search and execute and in a couple of seconds next finds the bending sequence and I confirm and close now I can see all the bending steps it's visual in 3d as you can see next is using two bending stations for this part uh, there are no collisions and this is the best uh, bending sequence and now next we'll create the CNC program to be run on the press break itself. And if I click on menu and automatic and just update and continue. Right now I am ready to start the bends and produce my parts. We can see all the steps. And as we keep on producing, uh, we will see the movement of the, the machine on the controller as well. 